This is a Wacomico County Public Schools sports break. Losing in last year's state championship game and losing all five starters from a season ago, while high basketball, Coach Butch Waller says he's got some work to do. When a public high school basketball program loses five starters, that's a blow. That's a blow. The main thing is not going to be the X's and O's. It was going to be getting everybody together, chemistry. And we've been working on that since day one. Now, the cupboard's not bare. Waller does have some talent returning from last year's state runner-up. And I'd love to have five six-foot-one Ronnie Satchels because he is what he lacks in ability, he makes up in heart and determination. Jason Handy has really gotten better in the last two years playing down on the block. Um, he's got a lot more confidence. Wahai also has three transfers into this year's program, which has the players feeling confident about the season. I'm pretty confident that we can still be good. Uh, I just, we just need to make sure we get team chemistry down and stay focused on the bigger goals. Got a couple new players here and there, and we got a whole new starting five, basically. I feel like we're going to get it running and ready to go. According to Coach Waller, one thing is certain. Why High has to be ready every single night. It's like everybody sort of circles psychologically at Why High, and, and we get everybody's best shot, which is, I, I look at it as a compliment. This is the 54th season for Coach Butch Waller, and it's the second without his wife Sandy, who passed away in 2018. Coach says it's the kids that keep him going. It's a little harder, means I don't have Sandy anymore. Uh, sort of out there by myself, but basketball is saving my life right now. Uh, I don't know what I'd do without it. With a preview, the Wahai Boys Basketball Team. I'm Paul Butler, Wacomico County Public Schools.